The less than perfect finances over Guam hosting the Festival of Pacific Arts is once again in the spotlight after a letter was fired off highlighting that local delegates have yet to be reimbursed for logistical expenses they fronted. PNC's Don De Jesus has more. Council of Arts and Humanities Chairperson Judy Flores wrote to the top officials for FESPAC this week, Guam Visitors Bureau General Manager Nate DeKnight and Adeloupe Deputy Chief of Staff Rose Ramsey, calling them out for not paying thousands to artists despite repeated requests. A spreadsheet included in the letter, which was copied to Island Media, shows that even with a lowered approved budget, more than $300,000 has yet to be paid. The council also specifically lists some $88,000 in expenses that were given to festival organizers but have yet to be processed. This lack of communication is being taken as a lack of appreciation, writes Flores. Quote, these artists have not received the courtesy of a response to thank them, to recognize their efforts, and have not received an acknowledgement of receipt of reimbursement requests for documented expenses, nor have they received any payment, end quote. Public Auditor Doris Flores Brooks on K57's Mornings with Patty said she too was waiting because despite the festival ending in June, her office has yet to receive information to conduct a post-FESPAC audit, supposing this could indicate that the finances are in the red. And I guess the, the situation really is that it appears that there are more expenditures than there is money to pay those expenditures. DeKnight also appeared on K57 this morning and explained why some of the submitted expenses are being scrutinized by GVB. There's times when we get a payment for, hey, we need reimbursement, and it's a, it's a handwritten paper that says, oh, you know, I bought $100 worth of Bucci Bucci, right? Mm -hmm. And I, I don't, I don't want to go in front of Doris with, you know, Hey, Nate, you paid this and you shouldn't have paid it. The Kaha chair wrote, the money requested represents legitimate, documented, and logistical expenses. Flores added, while recognizing the FESPAC committee is facing challenges to pay accounts due, quote, I appeal to you to first consider repayment to our artists, end quote. Reporting for PNC, I'm Donna De Jesus. Tonight says he will call a meeting to discuss the matter further, possibly slated for next month.